minutes and you take no prisoners. One minute you're up half a million in soybeans and the next boom. Your kids don't go to college and they've repossessed your Bentley. Are you with me? The revolution starts now. Starts now. We have to pass the bill so that you can uh, find out what is in it. Turn those machines back on! And we have to start by building a wall. A big, beautiful, powerful wall. Help me the money! You are fake news. Oh, good for you. And how was it? I don't know when they decided that they wanted to make a virtue out of selfishness. If we lose freedom here, there's no place to escape to. This is the last stand on earth. Well, that's a revolution here on Lake Effect Radio. We got some special people here. Hey, hey, hey. Hi. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Damn, that was do- well done. Thank you. Thank you. Very much. <laughs> <laughs> it's well done. You deserve. I guess I oh, get wow. my very first radio applause. Oh, no. I'm part of the applause. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Cool. All right. Sweet. You want me to introduce you or not? It's totally up to you. Yeah. Yes. Your choice. Yes. Yes. All right. Yes, please. Sudden cue. Subtle cue. Subtle cue. Ah. Yeah, da, da, da. <laughs> so, yes, we are Subtle cue. We are a rock band from Cleveland, Ohio, roughly. And that's Cleveland about, that is about it. And my name's Andy. Yeah, do you have anything Andy? interesting to say? Oh, I'm Aiden. Hi. <laughs> I'm TJ. There was too many A's in the band. I had to mix it up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> His name actually outcast. starts with an A. We had to rename him because we're like, no, we're not being the AAA band. Yeah, Scr- I, I had to do the Scr- whole that. legal thing. So, yeah. DMV is never fun. <laughs> no. Or going down and getting your name changed in that, down in that, you know, lovely uh-huh. State Institute place. I don't see that being super easy to do. I assume you need a lot of documents that your mom's got in the file box somewhere. And, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are you sure? No. <laughs> oh. I get bored. I have over a hundred and something sound effects. Ooh. That, that's pretty Dude, cool. I want that at my disposal all the time. Right. Boy, <laughs> <laughs> ah, got you first. Hey, yeah, you did. You did. <laughs> I'll get you. Happen. It will happen. At some point, you'd like this all night. He's going to follow me. Until it happens. <laughs> Got it. <You> did. <laughs> or did I just let him do it just because? The world will never know. I don't even know. Well, I guess you're going to have to have us in again. Ah. True. Yeah. yeah. Episode two. Always down. Subtle Q. Two. Subtle two. Subtle two. <laughs> <laughs> pun. Yeah. Nice pun. Yeah. That's what you. That's what you revert to when you have no sense of humor, like me. You have to use puns. Like I know words, but I don't know jokes. Hey, so, never oh, this word it. sounds like that word. Hey, that's a joke. Look at me. I'm funny, right? Say I'm funny, TJ. You're funny. Okay, thank you. <laughs> never <laughs> underestimate the power of a good dad joke. Tell you what, yeah. Well, tell oh you what. yeah. Oh yeah. They go a long way. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Dude, sorry, I, I had nothing else to say. Mm. Dude, go a long way. Almost as long as a spermatozoa. Has what? to go. A spermatozoa. Yep. No, that is. It's a sperm. <laughs> it's a sperm. Yeah, oh, I'm, 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 more I'm getting, I'm getting all collegiate way. on you. It's the long way. We're in college, you know, so I'm going to use the full <laughs> Latin term for everything. Oh, man. That I'm st- I just nailed English, like, last week. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's speaking in full sense. <laughs> I'm going to call you, like, Andriatus or something. See? You're not that's, Andrew anymore. That's a cool-ass name. Nice. It is. Andriatus? Andriatus. I'm assuming it has the same root as I need to change I'll my name it, again. I'll put that on the name tag. <laughs> Speaking right. of names, we'll get to this. So where did the name come from? Well, um, I had these flashcards to help me learn the alphabet when I moved to America. And um, <laughs> my favorite letter from a visual perspective was Q. But it had a really tiny little um, leg off of it. Like one of those little, you know, the little squiggly ones, the fancy Q? Yeah. I thought, that's a subtle Q. Yeah, the, that's where you it came know, from. That one. Yeah, I yeah, gotcha. Squiggly. So I said, no, really. Um, there's there's multiple stories about how it came up. Um, a friend of mine was in a class and they had um, the phrase "subtle cue" in their textbook, and he kept saying it over and over. And so we kind of pulled on that, but uh, turned it into a capital letter. 
instead of CUE. I got Thus it you. was born. Cool. I didn't even know that, so that's really cool. Interesting facts. Yeah, I've only been <laughs> in the band for like six weeks, so it's yeah. well they've they've played together before, but we're 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 very new. As a unit, it's probably we got probably a total of six to eight, maybe seven or eight weeks, but I think it's closer to six. So, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's true. Because we just we started p- practicing for the Grog Shop show in February. Two shows every two weeks until yeah. last Saturday. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and we're, re- we're recording an album in early May. Is there? Nice. Yeah. What's the name of that studio, TJ? It's called Spider Studios. It's Spider at Olmstead Studios. Falls. That's where <laughs> I'm from. Okay. It looks and really nice. I'm excited to go down there and work with those guys. It's gonna be yeah. Nice. No, it's, yeah. It's, I've worked there before. It's great. Yeah. <laughs> cool, cool. Yeah, so everyone can check us out. We have Instagram. Subtle at Subtle Q Band. We have Facebook, just Subtle Space Capital Q. Yeah, that's how we um, stumbled across you guys oh, really? on yeah. Instagram. Nice. Sweet. Oh, really? Glad wow. to know it's working. Yeah. Yeah. Right? yeah. You know, you guys just looked at us and you were like, "Oh, these guys seem like they know what they're doing." Well, not including yeah, you guys followed us. Oh, okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so <laughs> it's like you know, that looking into things, it's like, yeah. Why not? Yeah. Why not have us in? Well, yeah. Hopefully, we can. Uh, impress you yeah. with the actual music yeah you want to well you it? impressed us to get us to message you fair enough yeah. fair enough see i had to turn that around on him. <laughs> <laughs> i get bored happens not really i just felt like saying it yeah, yeah. <laughs> i like saying most things as long as i got a microphone I'm like yeah I'm just gonna say words. Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised you're not just sitting there saying word, 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 word. I don't want to annoy everybody, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Slowly annoying individuals at a time. It's a method. That way, there's always an audience. <laughs> it just dwindles, you know. <laughs> so how did you guys all meet? All right. Well, uh, I lived in Euclid a couple years ago. And we were throwing a massive party at my house with a DJ and everything outside. And uh, this guy came walking up my driveway and was like, yo, I live down the road and I heard you were having a party. Mind if I join? I was like, absolutely not. So we started talking music, started drinking, and uh, and then we started jamming. I mean, started playing. Yeah. And then TJ and I met um, because another version or another band I was in was playing um, a show with TJ's band, The Screaming Eagles, who are putting out an, out an album soon, so look them up. Um, and TJ and I just sort of talked and hit it off. They had a, The Screaming Eagles had a house party a couple weeks later or something, and I went to that and saw them play, and we just sort of started talking and hit it off, and the rest is history. Yeah. And he's the third piece that we were looking for years ago when we started playing. We took a hiatus, rejoined. And he showed up two weeks later, and it's been uh, great ever since. Yeah, yeah, I sort of parachuted into this band because I had a show lined up for Subtle Q, the act that used to be Subtle Q, um, in February, and then the other guys quit. And so I had to I had to fill the show or cancel. I didn't want to cancel, so I asked Andy, and he was he was down to play, and then I asked TJ, and we came together and jammed. It was like, this is so much fun yeah. it was like the best like first jam ever it was just it fit so well the vibes were all there i was already writing bass parts for songs i didn't know it was just it just flowed really well so it was easy yeah it was like the best accident ever mm-hmm. <laughs> <In a way>. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. we accidentally made a band that's, ah. a, that's the best band it's the best band i've ever been in me, Me too. too. It's also the mm. only band I've ever been. Don't worry. So TJ, you don't, have to, you don't have to say anything. The Screaming Eagle. The Screaming Eagles <laughs> rock. One? Yeah. I'll get some more. The Screaming Eagles we'll are very eventually. good. eventually. This is going to be an ongoing count. Oh, no. Keep telling what? yourself that. We're going to we're gonna have to get a tally going. Dude. No. He got it. Already did. Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> Three to one. <laughs> it's going to be like one of those prison like walls like where there's just like all the, all the weeks it's been. Yeah. Until I get I mean, out. I mean, <laughs> well, that's how I feel like it's cool. Here, you should yeah, put a subtle cue sticker for every moment. <laughs> well, I've got a, a bag full of them. All right. We're good. Yeah, every yeah. time he does it, we throw one yeah. on the wall. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. There'll be so many. <laughs> Sound effect, visual effect. Sound effect, visual effect. We're artists Sound effect, as well. Visual effect. Let's see. Oh, Bamba. Yeah, that's what they said. 
Let's see. What is this a Will they join or just chat? What? I guess oh, someone. Will they jam? Sing. Yes, or we're jam. going to play. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. I guess we yeah. can play a song. I don't know. You got all this shit here, I guess. Oh. Right. Shoot. All this shoot here. No, it doesn't all this matter. Stuff here. Wait, which word? Ah, oh, my brain hurts. Right. As long as those big words, you muffle. <laughs> Lots of apparatus. We have a lot of apparatus in the building. In the in the edifice. A lot of apparatus in the edifice. First one's uh, Wasteland, right? Oh, yeah, we're playing Wasteland, Wasteland first. Is okay, the first song? Ready? Yep. Sound. The level's okay? Yeah. Cool. 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 Alright. Let's see the people out there in the chat world. Especially because it's a few people out there in that. Let's see. Cat Lady. Love oh. those guys. Oh, yeah, thank you. We love you. <laughs> I like, yeah, cat, one, two, I like three. cats, too. 
that? Then add on one, two, three. That's a pretty good name. Starts so with the actual K, not a C. Yeah, her name's Caitlin. That's spelled K A T. Okay. So, so that's probably her. her. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Shout out to Katie. What's up? Thanks for yeah, listening. Yeah, it What's up, is Katie? her. I love you. I'd say I love you, but I'm scared of Andy. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> uh, Tell us how this really makes you feel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't know I was going to How does... Ah! <laughs> sis, sis. I quit. I'm out of the room. <laughs> I guess we'll replace him with the drum midi. <laughs> I mean, he's going to be our drummer, I guess. So, yeah, no, that's... I'm not huge into drumming. Me <laughs> neither. <laughs> <laughs> okay. A little tucked in there. So that song is called like... Wasteland. That's going to be on our LP coming out. I don't What's know What's the when. LP called? So... White Collar Trash. Uh, yeah, that yeah, is. White Collar Trash. Yep. I'm much more confident about that name than it sounded. There was a, uh, a band <laughs> debate about the, about the name. Yeah. Very, very lighthearted friendly debate yeah I got you a debate that was about three I don't remember the third <laughs> <laughs> I, mean. I remember the third and the first but I don't remember the second or... it, it was uh, well I don't want to get we might use that one again yeah. okay. or like or the, or the first one yeah. I'm not gonna yeah. We'll yeah. so yeah the, the album will be called White Collar Trash and hopefully it'll be out in like August June e? yeah well uh, digitally yeah we're, we're gonna press LPs so that'll probably take a little longer oh yeah so uh, yeah Limited edition presses will be available sometime later this year. Yeah. Soon to be on Spotify. There you oh, go. But, there you go. Yeah. That was Spotify. Well I used to work yeah, in retail, so. Get on Spotify for sure. We'll do all that. Yeah, we have videos on YouTube now. And, uh, yeah. Things. You can just search Subtle Q in YouTube and it should come up. With a, with a capital Q. Yeah. Yeah. Let's Let's see. Lindsay, Red Song, guys. Loving it. Oh. Hi, Lindsay. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I had my advisor across the street over at the other building at Holden and that. So, who are your musical inspirations? Oh, man. Um, dead Presidents. Not the band. Huh. Actual Dead Presidents. Oh. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, fifth century Chinese philosophers. BC, not AD, because that's just pff, fuck, freaking crazy. Um, what else you got? Uh, <laughs> I got nothing. No, I like I like Nirvana and Modest Mouse. Those are like the two pop bands I like the most. I'm really into what Kathy Opie does um, with her photography. <laughs> I was thinking of throwing an art one. I went to art school. I got gotcha. you. I don't know. I uh, just like music. I, I listen to a lot of metal. I can't play metal worth crap. So. So we decided to start a pop band. Yeah, right. <laughs> I can't play metal guitar because I'm just too lazy. I guess growing so. up, I played a lot of like alternative rock when I was practicing drums. So alternative rock is my inspiration. Yeah, yeah I'd say I'd say I, I grew up in a pop punk band and an emo band. So I mean, though I have a lot of other influences, I feel like the most I've played has been those kinds of music. So we are we do all have that influence for sure. I got gotcha. you. Yeah. So, yeah, they're about to. Yeah, about jamming out in that. Oh, uh, okay. All right. What, so we're caught up in that with that chat. Cool. What did we say we were playing second? City? Yeah. Hold on, let me get the list. Oh, yeah. yeah. It was City. Phone call. Was it? Oh, it is City Living. Yeah. City Living. And then. You could take your phone call later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know the numbers, so. You're ruining the spotlight. You ready? <laughs> so you already quit? What's up? So you already quit? Yeah, I quit. This, I quit this, quit this radio show wrecked <laughs> subtle cue. I'll never. I'll, we had a good I'll always have terrible months. memories of. <laughs> I throw something, but I'm stuck in this corner. All right. Andy, you start this one. Yeah. Ready? Oh, I'm gonna yeah. turn my mic off so it's not.
everything is shitty. Everybody's fun and nobody is with you. Always are in doubt when everyone is free. They call them crosses. Everybody thinks it wins without thinking losses. They didn't even call them X, they call them. Forgot about the lyrics. <laughs> oh, you know, you sing on that one, Aiden. Huh? You sing on that one. Yeah. <laughs> Just a little bit. Just a way little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Next. My is fault. Warm. Oh, you want to do A to Z? It is. Well, that's next, apparently. Yeah, we did. We could probably get through without chit chat on one. Oh, yeah. Lindsay. Say your heads. I want to see see you and stop uh, hiding off of the other camera. Oh. Yeah. I didn't realize I was out of the out of the frame. That's I didn't realize it. Here, I can, uh... There oh, you here go. we go. There you go. Yeah. Hi, Lindsay. Love you, if you are my Lindsay. If not, I love you anyway, <laughs> but, you know, I'm not trying to be weird. <laughs> <laughs> just not in the same way. Yeah. Right. Just not as much. Wow. <laughs> um, all right, A to Z. Yep. <laughs> I was born with some math So I took the least resistant path From A to B And I didn't do me
Very nice. Thank you. Thank you, sound effect crowd. <laughs> you have any questions back there, Mike? Um, well, first of all, I'd like to say it's, it's awesome so far. Oh, thank you. Thank you, we appreciate and, that. And uh, I guess I'm just going to go right to, like, the weird ones. Like, what's your favorite food? Mm. You guys got a good one for that? Um, I like poutine. Poutine? Poutine? Poutine. You like the, the poutine. cheese, the, the, the fries with the gravy and the cheese yeah. curds. <laughs> I haven't had that in years. Wow. Oh, good. my. There was this, uh, mm, I'm not going to remember it right now. There was something that Whole Foods made. It was, like, um, called a Mexican lasagna, and they would have it on their hot bar, and it was amazing. It was so good. All I can remember is that it was basically what you think about. It's like a taco, but a lasagna. And I, I try to go, I always go to Whole Foods and look for it. And if they don't have it, I don't get anything. But if it's there, I, bu I buy like $15 worth of it. <laughs> what, what about you, Mike? What's your favorite food? Uh, I, I think uh, generally cheese, but it's like specific cheeses. Italian cheeses, cheddar. Okay. Uh, Stuff like that. All right. Cheese is good. Cheese are good. Mm -hmm. che yeah, cheeses are good. That's a good point. <laughs> I didn't say that. I said cheese are good. I like Richard's <laughs> cheese, personally. <laughs> but thanks for making me sound smart. I like it. <laughs> cool. Yeah. No. <laughs> 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 See, I felt bad for him. That's why I looked at and he, like, him. He looked at me and was like, I got you like six times, bud. Like, <laughs> <laughs> a little, a little, a little low hanging fruit there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you almost had it. You gotta be quicker than that. Right. Now I wanna go to Canada and get some poutine. You don't gotta P go that poutine. far. Hey, let's go. It's true. And bacon. And bacon. I know their maple syrup is supposed to be divine. Uh, are you gonna smuggle it? Is that a thing? Are we going to do like a Smokey and the Bandit version, but with Canada? Oh, the, Can Canada. the Canadian border is super secure now, man. I remember when you could go over without a passport, and they'd just be like, yeah, come on in, eh? And now, yeah. yeah. Now, now like, no more. You, now you, it's just like you, going you, every you other dang country. Americans trying to come in and Very take our resources. I would like Our maple healthcare. syrup. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean, I think I'll take free health care over maple syrup, but, you know, I can take maple syrup back home. Not free health care, necessarily. <laughs> That is not a portable good, no. No, unfortunately <laughs> not. No. I gotcha. <laughs> so what drew you the, to this part of wanting to go into music? Um, I like music. Guitar Hero. Guitar Hero. I got Guitar Hero for the PS3, or, or it was Wii. It was one of the consoles, and I loved the music because I never listened to rock music before. And this was like when I was like 11. And I was just very, very excited. And I was like, you know, I should just try to actually do it. Because I was already kind of doing it, right? Five, five things in a, <laughs> in a pick. So, you know, it was, uh, it was rewarding, I'd say. I need to stop playing guitar here after I got a real guitar. Yeah. When you can't play sports, you need another way to, uh, you know. Yeah, and I did not impress girls. enjoy sports. <laughs> Oh, I never got into music to to impress girls. No, that was totally a joke. I didn't. If, if I did do, get into music for that, I failed horribly. <laughs> yeah, I Says the married one. Yeah. yeah. Well, I got. Well, I got. I got one. Just saying, girls plural. No. I just always liked music. My dad got an electric drum kit when I was a kid, and just ever since then, I was like, oh, I want to play the drums. My cousin played the drums, and uh, I was always more into the, like music and trying to teach myself guitar and stuff than I was video games. Now, I, I play you. more video games than I used to, I'd say, for sure. But it's getting nice out, so I haven't played as much lately, which is nice. Yeah, it was a gorgeous day today. Yeah. Well, it was all, so far only been two good days. As long as it's above 35, it's good for me. Ever since, you know, <laughs> Sunday and Monday. Oh, I, I played a gig on Saturday night, and I had to, like, stay at the place. I wasn't gonna, but I just, like, it was a house show, thankfully. Because huh. I could just sleep on, like, a couch, but, man, I'm not driving <laughs> home. I had to drive home in that one. We were going, like, max, I think, 35 down 90 the entire way from, like, what was it, Bedford to Painesville. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be horrible. No, the good news is it was, like, 1 in the morning, so... Yeah. Made it a little easier, right? 
<laughs> well, skinny off the road. It's still that, you know, line. Yeah. It's still there. Well, there was no lines. No, it was just all snow. Is that what you meant? No. <laughs> oh, that. <laughs> you missed it by a long shot. Long shot. He's Wait, talking no. about cocaine. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, that sort of, you know, line of, you know, risk. Oh. And all that. Yeah. 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 Well, I wasn't that tired, which was good, but... Maybe that's why... Well, no, was. with the, the weather and that, yeah, snowing yeah. and that, and Well, I got to use my girlfriend's four-wheel drive Jeep, and that helped a lot. If we were in my car, we'd have been dead, probably, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> a little two-wheel drive Jetta that needs new brake pads. <laughs> Not that yeah. that has anything to do with traction in the snow, but still. <laughs> <counts>. <laughs> Braking in the snow is important. Yeah. Sometimes. Just a little. So, I mean, if you want to stop. You can down shit. Just a little. If you don't want yeah. to stop, but, you know. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I mean, sometimes true. when I get in the car, I don't want to stop. I just want to keep driving. Kind of like uh, Thelma and Louise. Exactly. Yeah. That's where I was going. I think yeah. Off a Cliff beats into, like, a building. I think yes. Off a Cliff is more fun because you have the Wee! Especially with helicopters <laughs> oh, and a whole pardon. squadron of police that have been tr <laughs> crossing s state borders to try to get you. Yeah. That would be the way to go. That's up there as far as deaths. Yeah. Parachuting. Skydiving. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I would never do that. Oh, squished no. body. Oh. <laughs> well, you, you would, you'd never see your squished body. <laughs> I can I mean, feel it, though. Wow. I just felt it. <laughs> I just felt it. Someone right else now. has to deal with that. Someone else has to scrape you up off the oh, tarmac, you know? <laughs> oh, oh. That's a new sensation. Oh, my goodness. We went from, you know, learning music to impress girls to scraping TJ off the tarmac. Yeah, you know? we that's that's how we go. We're circle of life. You know? Subtle. It happens. Circle. I didn't expect to live that long anyways, so. Hmm. Oh, well. From a year from today. As long as you make it through the album. From a year from today. Where do you guys want to see yourself? Are you asking if we want to play another show in a year? <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be the best Not necessarily. Um, band out there. <laughs> Here. We're, nothing less than world domination, platinum albums, two platinum <laughs> albums. Best yeah, I'd say two is pretty good in a year. Uh, We're about to finish one. We want to play the Q. We want to... Or outside um, the Q. <laughs> or, or, yeah, or, busk, or we'll be busking outside the queue. Uh, what else? What other Unreal? Oh, we want to be on Rolling Stone. That'd be cool. Yeah. And uh, uh, <laughs> I don't even know what is uh, big anymore. We want to be on the front page of Pitchfork Media. What is that? I want there to be a parody Sorry, article sorry. from the hard times about us. Yes. Because that would, that would mean we made it. All this in one year? I want Eminem this? to make a diss track about us to yeah. try to provoke us into making a song <laughs> in response. <laughs> if we could uh, open for the Black Keys, that'd be cool too. Oh that God! Modest realistic. Mouse is touring with the Black Keys. That's a hard. That's a hey, high we'll bar. Be the that'd third be a cool band. Song, though. I mean, that'd be fun. Why not? That's possible. Hey that's man, possible. If, you, if you know, if you know, um, uh, Dave, you could get us in. I don't know mm. the other kids. I would literally, Patrick. I would literally puke well, out of nervousness think. before that show. <laughs> really? <laughs> Yeah. It was a band about a year ago. They traveled over to where the Black Keys first recorded over and was rec over there recording their album. Mm. And that, if that's possible, it's a hey. lot of stuff that's possible. For sure. No, we're going to make it. Yeah. I no, think. we do want to succeed. That's All that stuff was a little bit of a joke, obviously, but we do want to, we do want to put out music and have people listen to it and sell copies of our albums and everything. We definitely need um, to start... I personally am really bad at the whole social media thing, so yeah. we'd like to get at least for sure a, a stronger social media presence too, so we can reach out farther. Our friend Tyler, uh, shout out to Tyler Day, he's been helping us with the Instagram. He's probably the one who helped us find Lake Effect on Instagram, because I'm really probably. dumb with the social yeah. media. Um, I do know of your, of your guys' show, but I haven't probably listened to it once. I was a Lakeland student once upon a time, so I've walked past this booth a lot. <laughs> well, you probably seen since the last time you were here, and that the changes that have been within the booth. I've only been on that side of the window. Well, looking in. Oh yeah, yeah. No. That somewhat changed. Was this that way? You had a no. big, you had a massive board before, didn't you? With a bunch of different switches and stuff, or is it always? No, like it was a little bit smaller. This is actually new from over the summer. Oh okay. And that. 
Yeah, at one point in time, like this top turret was one there, there. Oh, oh okay. That you yeah. could never always see in that front window. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, I guess yeah. that's true. Kind of look around. It's and a nice I, space. I think, it, I think it's more efficient the way uh, it was described in the past. This seems super cool. I mean, you can see out both windows, so that's a positive. Yeah, right. Well, that's like before. It was like a tunnel. Yeah. Oh. You, where you're standing, you couldn't see because it was that was there. Uh, see, you got you guys. You, you would have just seen the top of your head. I mean, I could have bounced. <laughs> TJ does have a great jump. Yeah, we wouldn't be easy like ups. this. <laughs> it's true. Yeah. I, I usually dance a lot more, but as you can see, I'm very yeah. limited. In tight space. Yeah. yeah, when we have a full He's stage, so TJ fine, jumps. Usually. Sometimes it feels like you could jump over me in a single bound. <laughs> you jump, TJ, when he plays bass, he, mo he gets into it and he jumps up high in the air. Sometimes I look over and I'm like, who's that 6'5 guy playing bass? Oh, that's TJ. I used oh, to now, he's, now he's TJ height again. Oh, man. I used, to, I used to do so much crazier stuff when I had a wireless because I was in a band where the guy was insistent that even though we played in spaces about this size, we have wirelesses. So, like, sometimes when we had big, like, stages, I would just run around the entire venue because I didn't need to sing at all. So I was just like, I'll just run, get people's attention. <laughs> I haven't done that in a long time. I should get a wireless. There you go. I could be running around right now. Yeah. <laughs> could like be running stairs, all stairs, around the campus. <laughs> Don't tempt him, he will. Yeah. That'd be great, I want him to. <laughs> Got a question? Uh, well, I might have had a comment, but I lost it. Uh, that's, that was about, uh, Running around breakers with a wireless? <laughs> yeah. Played on top of tables? <laughs> I think it was like, yeah, but if you did need to sing, you could also just, like, get a wireless mic. Oh, like Death so, Leopard? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or Britney Spears. Or Britney Spears. Britney Spears is a more <laughs> contemporary example. That's true. Yeah, you always see her with the little mouthpiece thing. Then you have Mayonnaise King. Hello. Mayonnaise King. Hi, Mayonnaise King. Hi, Mayonnaise yeah. King. I had mayonnaise. some mayonnaise on my sandwich earlier. Mayonnaise it's nice is to meet good, you in so person. Are you the king of good. mayonnaise, or are you a king who likes mayonnaise? I think I know who that is. Or... Yeah. <laughs> or... Well, like you know. <laughs> like Ileana. Yeah. Looking was to look at you through the glass stone. Was it stone both. sour? Yeah. <laughs> they said they said both. <laughs> yeah, they say hello again, Mayonnaise King. Is Tom Brady softer than Cristiano Ronaldo? Who is Cristiano? Ooh, it's a soccer player. I'm gonna go with um. Yes. Sorry, TJ. Well, I mean, I think everyone needs to weigh in, but. I think soccer is personally more of a rigorous sport than football. I mean, there's the tackling, which is, uh, for my opinion, stupid because it causes lots of damage to the body and the brain. But soccer is much more endurance-based, and since I'm an endurance athlete, in my opinion, I think soccer is more intense. So I'm going to go with Tom Brady softer. Plus, he's a quarterback. They're not even allowed to get hit in practice. What kind of BS is that? Like, all the other <laughs> players are getting out of practice sore, and the quarterback's just like, hey, how are you guys feeling? I feel great. You guys want to go to the bar? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that was nothing, huh? I feel, I feel like I could party all night. <laughs> I, uh, I hope that answers the question. Well, I've that tried works. to play soccer once and found out just how challenging it was to run that long <laughs> and that much, and I mean, like, sprint for that long that much. That's what I'm saying. But never got laid out in soccer either. I have in football. And that yeah. sucks too, but I don't know. I feel like I don't know enough about Ask them to define soft. soft. We're, in, we're in college. We need, to, we need to define our terms in order to have a discussion. Oh, you're in an institution so. of higher learning. We are. We're in an institution of higher... Kirtland State University. Something. I got a BFA in painting. <laughs> no, it's Harvard on the Hill. Harvard on the Harvard Hill. Harvard on the Hill. I was always a fan of Curlin State because I wrote it on a t-shirt once. <laughs> that's a, that's no, that's our other one because we're sitting on the side of a hill. I like it. Harvard on a hill. Harvard on the hill. <laughs> this is a really nice campus. I've never been here before. Yeah, I've never been here either. I'm a West Sider, so oh. this is the first time I've been this close to... I make fun of all colleges, not just Lakeland. When you get me started about mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the one I went to is, is worse. Um, so I guess Tim figured out who, you know, Mayonnaise King was. It was Ben in Disguise. Oh, I, I figured. 
That's what I thought. Hey, just glad someone's listening. Yeah. For sure. No, you got a few people out there. Thanks for everybody. Yeah, thank Thanks you to everyone who's listening. I always wondered if like local I did it radio again. <laughs> guys, you can he- you can know how many people are listening to you at any given. Oh time. yeah, like this number. Even though you have the Android app that's not counted to that, not including the other channel that's not counted to that number. Even though it's just like yeah, it keeps fluctuating. You know, from like eight up to like fourteen and that. Then that only counts people registered within the chat. Wow. All right. So it's, it's, someone got banned from the chat. There's like some some rumbling going on in there. Oh man. Yeah. That's our you know normal troll. Uh, There's always one, right? Yeah. yeah. He said they, he said we're fired, or she said we're fired. Oh, cool. I don't need. She, they job. said everyone's fired. I don't even have a job. Oh. <laughs> For at least another month. I guess I gotta... you're fired from unemployment. Yeah, who, uh, anyone want to base? <laughs> no, you can't fire her yet, because Lindsay has a question, which I was going to actually ask sort of near a similar thing of. But what is your favorite song on your album? Ooh. Who, are your, who is really your parents' favorite child? You know, it's like... Me? Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Except she's evil for one thing. She's making you pick one. Yeah. We like the new one, Wasteland, because it's new, and I'm, oh, and I haven't wow. played it as much. I do. I like it most because I haven't played it as many times. I like that one um, because we started off as a jam and then played it after played it at a show after only practicing it a total of six times and it wasn't a total crap fest. Yeah. So. <laughs> I, know, I tend to like whatever I did most recently because I find things wrong with the older stuff and I want to move stuff on. Stuff you want to improve. Yeah. I'm a big fan of uh, City Living. That one went from like my least favorite one to play to one of my favorite ones to play because... <laughs> I think discontinuity might be my favorite, just because mm. it's that just was like, groovy. like I can play that song without anything else going on, like no listening back or anything, because I just I just can feel the groove so well. So, right, sure. but they're all fun ba- songs to play on bass. So, yeah, I don't know. That's three different answers. That's that's pretty good. So wasteland, okay, so we picked one. City right? living, <laughs> discon. No, that's good. Yeah. Well, it gives a good spectrum of what we do because so like those ones too. Discount's like kind of like more of like a rocker. Yeah. City Living's more like a pop song, and Wasteland's more like I don't know what you would call it—a jam. I guess yeah. you'd call it a jam. Yeah. So. I like yeah. the, the variety, kind of that's provided. It's nice to not have to sit here and play the same thing in like every song. Yeah, I really like A to Z, which is the last one we played. Yeah. Um, but I've been playing that for two years, you know, so it just kind of gets old. <clears throat> that one always gets to me, man. It's like you could tell there's like a lot of emotion the energy going on. and stuff yeah. in that yeah the energy. Yeah. I like the field field yeah. some real feels yeah hopefully, so hopefully hopefully we'll get more people um telling us what they think when we get our album out yeah yeah, yeah. Oh, the- yeah. especially Mayonnaise King saying what's up to you guys what's up what's Mayonnaise up Mayonnaise King? King how's it going Mayonnaise King how is how are the eggs treating you? What's your favorite thing to put mayonnaise on? <laughs> <laughs> that is a good question. A you can't just go through, You just can't come at me like mayonnaise king and not have a prepared answer for that. So I'm waiting. I'm sure. I follow someone on He's Instagram. He's going to be waiting, called. actually, for that. <laughs> Instagram, do you have a... Great, or right? Mayonnaise King, do you have an Instagram? Huh? It's going to be Mayonnaise King. Oh, <laughs> mayonnaise King. It's got to be. Yeah. I, I'm pretty sure I follow a Mayonnaise King or something. Yeah, legitly. Sticks or ELO? ELO. You're the classic rock guy, TJ. We need a we need a ruling professor. Oh no, ELO al- every day. That's what I was gonna say. Yeah. So, all right. ELO was like what made me think that pop music wasn't crap when I was 14 and only into metal. But then I listened to Queen and ELO, and I was like, you know what? I think like classic rock, like what it's, it's more like pop music is very good. And then that's how mm-hmm. I got into basically everything else I listened to. So, without ELO, partially. Wouldn't they don't have an Instagram account. Ah, man. And I'm not flattering, though. We got somebody saying Daisy Don't is their favorite. Hey, we're about to play that one next. Oh, we are? Yeah, that's the next one on the list. That's true. What a segue. That's a great segue. (laughs) Oh, yeah, so so far it's been Wasteland, City Living, and A to Z. This one's called Daisy Don't. This one's called Daisy Don't. To belong to a wondrous river's daughter I held out my tongue in a snowstorm And I caught her Yes, I did 
But the time of mine you'll always hold Stays with me as time makes my brain old And the livid wonders my soul Stuck in a time that I can't realize Well, Daisy, don't you know In a second show I still think of you River's daughter, a glimmering crystal born of filtered water. But will she know as I grow old? Can I keep her in the cold? Here in a time that I can't redefine. Well, Daisy, don't you know? And I say, River's daughter. I swelled out my tongue in a snowstorm and I caught her. But she melts as I grow. Can I keep her in the cold? Here at a time that I can't read inside. Well, Daisy, don't you know? That was better than on Saturday. <laughs> uh, I was in a way back in a different yeah. room on Saturday. I was going to say, this is better sound than, uh, than that, at least for the drums. For sure. What room consists of the system of a down? What? So what room consists of system of the down? What room? What, what? Yeah, is room. Is I don't know. Uh, I don't know, but I do love that band. Yeah, System of the Down. One of my favorite. Or games. consensus, or the, 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 the consensus on System of the Down. Oh, oh we're forum. Very, very forum. 
I'm Super gonna try to rowdy. see them when they come to. There's like a rock fest coming into Mansfield, I think, and they're playing Friday. And I was gonna try to just go to the festival that day because System of the Down is one of my favorite bands, and yeah. I I feel like this is the only chance I'm gonna have to see them. So at least it feels like it. Psycho, huh? groupie, cocaine, crazy. Psycho, psycho groupie, cocaine, crazy. Psycho, groupie, cocaine. Makes you high, makes you high, makes you really wanna go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, so that's that's a yes. So uh, what genre is your music? Rock. Yeah, I'd say, uh, well, Dave from the Chewy Center, shout out to Dave. He's a great guitar what player. Up, Dave? He said hey, Dave. that we were a mixer between um, Rush, the rock band, and uh, punk. Like, if we combined those two bands, like, like, the genre of punk with Rush, he said that was us. And I was like, that's probably the best description <laughs> I can think of. Like if the Beatles and Cage the Elephant made a baby. Oh my. Sort of. <laughs> and, and then that baby joined the Illuminati. What? Oh. <laughs> this baby oh, is man. so old. Like, how yeah. old is this baby? Six weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Grows up fast, man. Wow. Like me, it's good to hear you sing. Well, thank clearly you. Clearly, and that. Oh, someone's saying that. And I'm, I actually got. Good work, huh. studio master. Yeah, I'm actually yeah. appreciated. All right. Yeah, no, no, this we, is, this and we do great. appreciate because, like, <laughs> we can mix this, make it sound good with how close it is and loud it is. You got to know something. It's so nice not having to shout Yeah. to hear myself. Oh, well, amazing. this has been going on since, like, spring 2013. Oh. Musicians a lot, in and out, in and out. Okay. So you get a lot of practice. Yeah, I bet. Like sure. me. So I would hope to God I would know what I'm doing by now. <laughs> Otherwise, I deserve to be fired. <laughs> Let's see. I'm loving the beats of the music by Mayonnaise. Great lyrics, too. With the voice as well. Daisy. Let's see. Rush me. Go, go, Bordello. Yeah. All right. Yeah. What was it? Rush meets Gogol Bordello. I'll take it. I like that. I really like Man Man, mystery look. listener. If you like Man Man, I'm, I'm a huge Man Man fan. I like Gogol too, but I really like Man Man. We gotcha. Um, they're great. You should see them. They st I think they still tour. I don't know. It's a little huh? poppier now, but they, they played like a gypsy punk thing. Oh. With no guitars. It was basically no guitars. It was all xylophones or no marimbas. And I gotta like, see what this Like a Rhodes are. piano. The, the singer played like a Rhodes piano, but he... It was all messed up, so we'd like dance on it and, <laughs> and stuff and play the song. Right, I, love, I love I love like, like warm Lewis. weathered, like millionaire bands like to have worn weathered equipment. Like no, I've had this since like we started, and I freaking love this thing. Like I love that. Like I have a pair of drumsticks that I've had since 2008. Haven't broke them yet. Damn. Stopped nice. using them a couple weeks ago, but they're on they're in a case on the wall. Yeah. Might as well. It happens. Yeah. Those are my drums. You got like Sharpie writing all over them because I was an angsty teenager. Middle school, like. <laughs> one and two and four. What? <laughs> they had to write the music on this day. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, Mayonnaise, how long have you guys been a band together? Um, Six yeah. or seven weeks. Yeah. Yeah. yeah we, like, I only played with um, Aiden, I think, once before I joined the band. He just invited me to come over and just, you know, you play music. You do that with friends. And, you know, and then he was like, he's just like, hey, man, you should join this, this band I'm in. It's like, it's, a, it's very new, but and it doesn't actually, feel like it. We've, uh, he just moved, so we lost, we lost a practice spot. Got one today. <laughs> so, so ran everything over there, set up, and then took it down and then brought it all over here. So, I mean, we probably played, like, three times the past two weeks, and two of those were shows, so. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah, they, basically. Yeah. Yeah. So we are out of shape, I guess. Yeah. 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 It happens. Well, we're going to re rehearse lots over the yeah. next month. We're yeah, with we the album coming up. Because we're recording. It's going to be cool. It's going to be fun. I'm excited. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm, I'm already thinking of album artwork that I've been yeah. looking at. Yeah, I have a lot of source material, so Ooh. I'll bring some stuff out when I get a chance. Sick, yeah. Sick, nasty. Sick, nasty. Yeah, I haven't even, 
I had an idea for the album we were going to put out when we had our first band, but that's there's a lot of different songs, and I don't that's know. That's still, like, the idea that we bounce around, like, all dressing up and, like, business casual, but looking like trash for the White Collar Trash album. Or can we just dress up in suits and, like, I don't know, act like we're, I don't know. We're rebels. Doing something punk, really bad. Yeah. Like, I don't know, just we doing something just, really trashy, like, like beating up, like, a homeless person or something just like, like the trashiest thing you can think of we can sit like <laughs> at a dive bar in suits just drinking pbr at a table there you go hey That's man better. pbr if you want to sponsor us we'll give you on our with, a, with a pack of newports on the table you know like just <laughs> this has been brought to you by <laughs> oh here you go give this man on bass a solo mid song oh, next shit. song <laughs> next song mm. next song is <laughs> free will wait <laughs> We could do that. I mean, I have a very fun part for Free Will. So it's basically How about like I just, a whole solo. What if I just don't play for the first bridge? You know what I'm talking about? No. <laughs> but, <laughs> no well, we, I guess I, I still play for the solo. I just don't do anything crazy. I just keep the beat. Yeah. So. Well, the, it's like the end. The bridge is that end part that I forgot on Saturday. Oh, okay, okay. It's up to you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I could do it if you want, but... I know he needs to follow. It's not really guy. a solo song. Nah. But we just you can just play a, a solo, bass solo yeah. right now. Yeah, hold on. Andy and I are just going to give you a light chord Dude, change. Um, what do you want, minor or major? Uh, it's, 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 it doesn't matter to me. I just need to know the roots. G, C, D, E minor. is a very competent bassist. I try to fit in the pocket. That's all. <laughs> you start something up. Do something funky. Oh, man. Okay. Safe. We played. We played. It's very safe there. <laughs> I didn't have anything in mind, so I was just like, ah, oh, well. It's all right. You, you played something funky. And Put, like putting it. us on the spot. I like mayonnaise. And I want to know where did the name come from. Let's see which which Tell lie which lie story. which lie have I used three. today? Let's hear one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. So, um, well, apparently, according. So there was this line. I was trying to I was trying to uh, get some cash out of the bank, and the ATM was broken. So I went and kind of like looked around. I couldn't figure out where to um, get in line. The banker is like, oh, the queue's over there. I'm like, 
what do you mean the cue? She's like, oh, the line. I'm like, oh, that cue was pretty subtle. I couldn't catch it. And so, <laughs> subtle. <laughs> Damn. No. Um, That's a good one. <laughs> just keeps recurring. Just like over and over throughout okay. your life. Um, yeah, I just day. basically I ran into a bunch of subtle cues forever, and I was like, oh, "That's a pretty cool band name, dude." Mm. So I just stuck with it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I had there was this car in front of me once, and this uh, had a license plate, like most cars do. And uh, there was a cue on the license plate, and all the other letters were very bold and very colorful against the white background, and the cue was sort of faded away. So I thought, "Wow, that's a subtle cue." <laughs> yeah. Nah. <laughs> wow, you should write these down. You could write a whole book about this. Well, no, the, the video grabs. It. The bad thing is you got to less, you know, listen in for a long period of time. But you know, mm -hmm. you have it. Part part of the fun of the name was that it, we don't really know what exactly what it means. I had an idea when I came up with it, but I have since changed. For me, when I first saw you guys in the VFW show, when I played with the Screaming Eagles, you guys were subtle cue. I thought it meant subtle question, like like. Mm -hmm. So I'm trying to ask you something, but it's a very sensitive thing, so I'm trying to be very subtle about it, so it's a subtle question. You're that's asking a I question. Thought. So it's like a subtle cue. It is like, up to interpret. Like a subtle Q and A, but yeah. a subtle Q. I just yeah. have a subtle Q for you. No, the, okay, so the true, the true honest answer is that my friend had a class, and there was some vocabulary term, subtle Q, in it. And uh, I decided to change it to a letter Q to make it more uh, search engine friendly, and it looked cool on paper, so... Subtle yeah, Q was born. Enough. Lots of deep meaning behind it. Yeah. So really, none of those are true. <laughs> <laughs> and and yes. all of them are true. But why male models? <laughs> what? Wait, which, where's the camera? I, I can't do it. I mean... <laughs> I can't really strike a pose very well. I do model on the side, so... This cord's making me feel like I have long, luscious hair. <laughs> Like, <laughs> this will blow really well. Nah. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you've uh, been waiting. Uh. All right. I know. I gave him some time on it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Should we play a song? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Free, Free will. will. <coughs> Do I really have to sing this song though? I don't know. Is it up to me? It's your. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> it works. <laughs> nice. <I'm... laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Hey, thanks. And they were saying, oh, I like that fade on that guitar in the beginning. Ooh. Thank you, yeah, Mayonnaise that's, King. That's a great, yeah. Yeah. It's a great thing. I like, I like pedals. Do, do they like you? <laughs> I hope so. I kind of stomp on them a lot. I'm a little rough on them. Uh, uh, you know, well, it's an abusive relationship. Oh, my. Well, they make great sounds for me, and I step on them. I guess if they're into it. <laughs> I don't know. They never they never said yes. Just, so I guess it's... Uh, Let's not get into yeah. it. We're, on, we're on a college, yeah. Objects. Consent is very serious stuff on a college uh, yeah. or campus. I shouldn't be. Ish. Yeah. Uh, Ish. Consent Ish. is important. Yeah, always. Very important, I would say. <laughs> Well, particularly, particularly thing. in a place where young adults are learning how to Probably the navigate them waters. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. No, it's a serious thing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We'll get good. off the soapbox. <laughs> but you were about to be on the soapbox again. I was about to be like reverse soapbox, like floating. With with di- with um discount. Oh. That's, that's the next one. If you want to play that. Yeah, one. I do. I, I do want to play that play one. That one if we're, if we time. Do we have time? Yeah. We can fit that in there, because we got to start rapping. Yeah, it's fine. It's, it's, it's three minutes. Little. we got to start rapping? It's, yeah, it's three right, minutes. Ish. No. Here, oh, we'll, we'll, do a, we'll do a band identification for a moment. You're listening to Subtle Q on Q Lake Mark. Effect Radio. <laughs> My name is Aiden, and Lake Effect is awesome. Jeremiah is awesome. Mike is awesome. Oh, do you guys have any CDs by King? Not yet. Oh, no, but we will soon. Not yet. Soon. The goal is... Okay, so if we record early, May 3rd through the 6th, yes. the goal should be CDs by June. Those are pretty easy to press up pretty quick. Um, I have a bootleg of our social Mahal media, show. And you will be able to yeah, be follow. updated on when everything's happening. We're also working on getting, like, T-shirts, hoodies, hats, yeah. whatever, you know. So we, All the get yeah. gadgets all, and things and all stuff. All the things you would expect to see at a merch table. <laughs> Along with these recordings, we we have recordings from the Mahal show we did on the 14th of March. We do. We have like that. Oh, no, it was the 16th. Yeah. And th- and there's like I think six of the songs on YouTube. So if you type in Subtle Q, you'll probably find those links there. They're just audio tracks. There's no videos, but that's yeah. that's that's what I've been listening to to practice. So it's yeah. it's, it's basically what you're hearing. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely give those a look if you're interested. Yes, please. Um, yeah. And you can, you know, you can definitely message us on uh, Facebook or Instagram. We will respond because we're just we're just three dudes. I can burn you a bootleg if you want. Like we got all we all gonna be up at work tomorrow. Like yeah. we're just three regular dudes. Yeah, yeah we're li- just oh, three no, dudes. So we will we'll, we'll be we'll be super flattered and answer if you message us about a CD or Seriously. something. Yeah, I'll also make you a mix if you want. He will. Yeah, I, I make mixes true. for anybody who's First, interested. TJ just get, TJ just got me one of the nicest gifts I've ever gotten. Oh, in, yeah. in my life. Yeah, it was his birthday yesterday. Um, it's like a deluxe copy of um, Nevermind with like all the out t- outtakes and all that stuff. It's good stuff. And, yeah. a, and a really cool book. Anyway. You want to play Discont? The point is TJ is a generous fellow. Okay. I try. Yeah, we're going to play a song called Discontinuity of Supply. And before it, I have to tell you, you've got a Mother Earth. She's got a limited amount of lithium, copper, iron, oil, etc. Water. You should Lithium. water. That's pretty you important. should probably start thinking about that. Helium. Anywho. Oh, okay. Discontinuity of supply. <laughs> Never say the press who hide. Pain is life with your goodbyes. Pain is dry and now he wants to fly. Brain is dry, will not look why. Pain is dry to say scarcity of supply. No worth left to mine
life outside of the lines. Let me find another reason why. And it's not, I will not let my DNA align. This continuity of your life. You'll never see the end of time. Better do something. I'm not a preacher. King now definitely be looking out for those CDs when they come out. Sweet. Awesome. Well, thank, thank you. Thank you, Mayonnaise King. We appreciate the support. I still don't know what you like to put mayonnaise on. Yeah. I'll be looking for your mayonnaise. Favorite thing, turkey, <laughs> ham, peanut butter, popcorn. <laughs> peanut butter? <laughs> you don't know. People are into weird stuff. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's true. Do you wash your car with it? Anything. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> uh, just... just it just sounds like you're egging your own car. Right, whatever. Right, I'm not, not egging, mayonnaising. Well, partially. Yeah. He's okay with it. That, whatever <laughs> floats his boat, you it, know. The only bad part about egging is the the cracked shells, TJ. No one that cares about the egg. The no one cares part. about the egg matter on your car. Oh, really? Well, uh, I did an art video one time in which I was using a lot of eggs, and let me tell you. The, the shells, they they uh, they stick to clothing a lot more than... Uh, maybe it's like the combination probably. of yeah. the like, yolk and the... <laughs> there, I, the basically, shell. I have a trench coat that has just egg all over it. You kept it. Nice. Mm -hmm. Can you wear it to a show? I mean, I have. Yeah. To a show. To a uh, show. It's probably super warm to it's wear a trench coat. At a yeah. Show. He answered you. <gasps> Salami sandwich. Uh, I was going to do it for a Salami sandwich. Nice. I enjoy slime sandwich. And Hellman's. What's it? Hellman's? This is my oh, favorite nice. brand of mayonnaise. So even nice. though you're a king, you you don't even go for the full Italian. You just eat salami. You're a king of the people. Yeah, man. I like that. Heck yeah. Salami sandwich king is what I eat, and I'm just a lowly mayonnaise peasant. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Keeping it real with the people. Oh, man. What a nice... Pretty much. I bet you could afford... Pe he could afford pepperoni. He's a king, but he doesn't. Yeah. yeah. True. True, true. <laughs> right. Yeah, I'll tell you that. I got nothing else for you guys. Cool. Thank you for yeah. having us. We played this yeah, song in practice. Yeah. 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 Right, yeah thanks right for coming in, guys. Absolutely. And I, it's been a good one. Yeah, yeah, we thank, you. You yeah, thank you. You got to know what mayonnaise and that. Yeah, you know, his thing. To meet him. That's cool. Thanks for everybody who took the time out of the night to listen to the podcast. Yeah, yeah this is I mean, fabulous. That's cool. Hi, all you fabulous souls. Thank you. We nice. appreciate you supporting local music, supporting local radio. What are all of our handles yeah. on the social yeah. webs? It's at Subtle Q Band is our Instagram. Our Facebook is just Subtle Space Q. Um, <laughs> subtle has a B in it. Um, yeah. We're not, we're not, we're not Subtle yeah. Q. But that is how you spell it. That is how you spell <laughs> it, yeah. Subtle, 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 subtle Q. Subtle Q. <laughs> so one of the um, guys in the Magnavoxes thought we were super Q. Remember that guy at the bar? Ooh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Honestly, super Q is but a pretty good But they have a good too. chunk, you know, 
that they were, I, I, I think, think I think we the were the drunkest box. people there. He wasn't in the Magnavox. He was Honestly. he was oh. with them though. Like he's in a band with one of the members of Magnavox. He called us super cute. Yeah. And they called us subtle Q on stage. It was kind of funny. Yeah, I was like, you guys don't know how to spell subtle. I'm huh, sorry. Exactly. Wow. I mean, no, no disrespect. They played Velvet Underground songs. So that was cool. Yeah. What yeah. TJ is trying to say is the Magnavoxes are terrible people. Well, <laughs> we, don't like them. We, don't, we don't like them. No, I'm kidding. Band. We love them. If you... I like their vibe. I know a friend that would really be into them, and I told him to hit him up. So hopefully they'll work with him at some point. No, the Magnavoxes are great. Um, the Chewy Center is great. We just played a show with them at May Halls. They're yeah, playing a show on like April 12th yeah. at the Winchester in Lakewood. So if y'all... Y'all want to make the drive out there? It's a, a they're a great band to see. I will make jam that. Band. I will I'm make that drive. There. Out of oh, the goodness so of my heart, I will drive to Lakewood. If there's any East Siders listening, they would like to see us play, but on the East Side, I know of a venue or anything because the only places I know are Rip like Cook places off. that take uh, where the Willoughby it will be. Yeah. Oh, that's hey man, idea. we All would right. love to play. Twenty it. or no, eighteenth, nineteenth. We have the gear for it okay. too. I have yeah. ribs. We should do a rib cook-off. <laughs> oh, We're going to cook DJ's they ribs. We're going to play a off. show, then do a human sacrifice yeah. and eat TJ's yeah, ribs. Uh, we have demos. That's fine. Yeah. Cool. We're yeah, we have, we, have, we have 10 songs. Um, Brewery company that's there. Yeah. And so on. It's uh, quite a few different places downtown. TJ, will you be offended if I put A1 steak sauce on your ribs before I eat them? Me? I mean, yeah. I mean, I'm probably not going to have much of a say in it after you cook me. So. I'm, ask, I'm asking yeah. out of courtesy. How do we get here? <laughs> I don't know. Talking about, like, I don't know. There needs to be ribs You're at a rib cook-off. TJ, TJ so. said he has he has ribs for the rib cook-off. Let's bring the music. Like, and he pointed to his chest. Yeah. Like these yeah. are ribs. I have several. I'm yeah. saying is, you got a problem. TJ's succulent more because I don't have not a lot of a lot of fat on me. You wouldn't yeah. be very very plentiful. I would say that. Yeah. All right. But adios, everyone. Right. Hey guys, thanks for listening. Thank you for listening. Thank you. We everyone. are Subtle Q, and we love you.